What is up YouTube? Magnus on a Rimsa here to show you the new level 90 talents for the Shaman Mist of Pandaria. First off, I'm going to talk you through each talent and then I'm going to show you what each talent looks like on a training dummy. So first off, Elemental Blast. Harness and direct the raw power of the element towards an enemy target dealing 27,898 elemental damage and increasing the cast's critical strike haste the mastery by 3,500 for 8 seconds. This talent is such an easy choice because you use a spell you get a buff. It's a cooldown the Shaman can use every 12 seconds to get 3,500 in a useful stat for 8 seconds, which means I could see a lot of Shamans in all 3 specs use this because it's such a simple spell to work with. Next up, Prime Elementalist. Your Earth and Fire Elemental Totems draw forth powerful primal elementals directly from the elemental planes. These servitors are 50% more powerful than regular elementals, act as pits directly under your control and gain additional abilities. This talent is by far the coolest talent in the Shaman Tree. It's also a very good talent because of two points. First, you get a fairly high DPS increase using this talent with Fire Elemental. And second, you get a cooldown for all three specs too by using the spell provided by the Fire Elemental. I can see this going into Shaman builds for all three specs. Last, Unleash Fury. Your elemental weapon imbues are empowered, granting additional effects when triggered with Unleash Weapon. Flame Tongue Weapon. Increase the enemy target's damage taken from your Lightning Bolt and Lara Breath abilities by 25% for 10 seconds. Wind Fury Weapon. For 8 seconds, your melee auto attacks can trigger Static Shock. Earth Leveling Weapon. Further increases the effectiveness of your next single target heal on a target ally for 50%. Frostband Weapon. Your Leech Heat from the enemy target gain 50% movement speed for, for 4 seconds. Rock Bitter Weapon. You take 40% reduced damage from the enemy target for 5 seconds. This talent might be the most basic choice for all 3 specs, but because of the damage and healing down increases from the Fire Elemental and the huge buff from Elemental Blast that increases the damage and healing you do, this is not what I would choose to go with on my Shaman. But I can't say I'm not sure which talent I will choose to go with on a Restoration Shaman yet, because Restoration is my main spec so that's what I'm looking for right now. I would like to thank you for watching, remember to like the video and comment down below what you would like me to do next and remember to check out my channel, the link is in the description. Bye guys!